In this episode of American Greed, The Fugitives, John Rufo appears to be a business owner, a good husband, and a loving son. He's very generous, and he was like the rock everyone leaned on. Yet he's secretly pulling off one of the most outrageous bank frauds in American history. And when he gets busted, he thinks of no one but himself. And then, boom, he's, he's gone. He is on the lamp. Totally shocking. He left very little trace. He just has to make one mistake. We can make many. He just has to make one, and we'll catch him. And later, in Florida, FBI agents are on the hunt for Mike Huarte, the godfather of Medicare fraud. This guy was like a ghost. He couldn't be caught. His name was nowhere. He got away with it for years. And he has a partner who is just as elusive. $100 million was ultimately billed by these individuals. That is a huge case. Then they slip up and get caught. But the Godfather's accused conciliary Ramon Fonseca manages to escape. It's a difficult situation when you put so much work into a case, only to watch them be able to walk away with potentially millions of dollars hidden somewhere. Thank you.